How's it going everyone? Welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to watch One Piece episode 652. Last episode we found out Rebecca's backstory. It's finally her turn now to fight in the Colosseum. Let's see if she'll be able to win. If you'd like to help support our channel, our Patreon link is down in the description below. You get early access to all the videos that we post onto our YouTube channel. You get full and carry actions to the One Piece series. So if you're interested in those, make sure to check it out. Now on to the anime, Ikimo Show. Dude, these guys all got fooled. ファンティンプリンセス。ファンティンプリンセス。ファンティンプリンセス。ファンティンプリンセス。ファンティンプリンセス。ファンティンプリンセス。ファンティンプリンセス。ファンティンプリンセス。ファンティンプリンセス。
だろうなスマイルがなければお前はカイドウに消され<笑>全て<笑> Oh he like that <笑> Oh <笑> He did a substitution right there Right on top of him. He loves this man. <laughs> this is what he did to Smoker, man. He likes to sit on top. He likes to be on top. Whoa. What? Oh, oh my god, oh my he's crushing him. He's withstanding it. Uh Oh, yeah, that's true. Oh, Log is to live. Duffy does not look like Why? that. Why does look, Law look so tiny next to these two? Caesar no Shinzo wa kai. That's like some Spider Man. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes, 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 <laughs> oh my god, they're so cute. Some of them are wearing little like animal hats. So they have ears. Ten years. Ten years. Ten years. Oh my god. 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 Oh Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my ルマユランドにちょんまげランドだ。いいぞ、もう <laughs> 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 What? She said, this is my attack. <laughs> <laughs> They're already distracted. <laughs> what? She doesn't need to cut them. <laughs> she won't do it because that's his rule. Do flamingos. The one before it was not like that. Hmm. Oh, she's not hurting people, so. Damn, she won all this time without ever going on the offense? Yeah. That's crazy. Hey, it wasn't her. <laughs> She, oh my she's god, strong. she's whooping these guys. Damn, does she have hockey then? That's what I was wondering, because like, so far it seems like a lot of people that joined actually do have hockey, mm -hmm. right? So... Observation? It'd be kind of crazy if she doesn't have it. That would benefit Oh, her. observation, yeah. maybe. That'll yeah. help her, like, stay safe. That's true, that's true. That could be it.
<laughs> it's such a like evil mastermind <laughs> smile <laughs> or laugh. It is. <laughs> Oh, here we go. 800 years. You weren't even alive yet. What are you talking about? Oh, government. What? He's going to be like he's a descendant, isn't he? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. アラバスタのネフェルタリ家だけはそれを正確には10区の数。おお、わあ。今もなお。That's crazy. リクイチゾ創造主として聖地マリージョアへと旅立ったのがノーノーフィッシュウェイヨーヒーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノーノー
forgot that he's a 90 year old man. <laughs> it's so creepy. <laughs> Where is she now? Damn, she changed the whole environment. What? How far does this go? That's What's pretty the range? strong. Yeah. If everything's art, doesn't that mean you're already a piece of the art? Because they're on top of it? It's already over. <laughs> what happened what? here? <laughs> What is that? Is that his hair or a hat? His brain. What? His brain? He's the mastermind. Relax. Oh my god. Oh, it's his hair. Gladius. Whoa, Whoa, that's some that's crazy, crazy hair. hair. Yeah, <laughs> so cool. Still, I'm not touching you. Yeah, Waka or Agiriatsu are you Christian? Damn it, I'm not touching you. Chanto Yakso no Minato de Matta de Kunaka Minato are more Kai hair that's the eight by you. Then the Yonsek. Saite demo, Sanzeni three thousand. What? I mean, whatever. Oh, the Navy delusion. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. What? Oh, oh no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, her power is so cool, oh, actually. Oh, it disappeared? Barrier, barrier. Game over? <gasps> what? She ate it! She truly ate it! It's gonna be art? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> she redirected it! <laughs> no way! It's the same attack? Oh, oh my god, Brooke. No! Whoa, that's some rubber hands what? right there. <laughs> He's just running around. <laughs> and it's over. Oh, she can't do anything to that. No, she no might actually been killed from this. <laughs> Technically, Sunny defeated her. <laughs> she got defeated by the ship. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, there's some kind of barrier. Yeah. 
She encloses them in. What? You're still okay? How? Oh my god. She's so tanky. Whoa, what was that? He's gonna go into dragon mode. <laughs> He's done with her. Now they're just beating her. Yeah, no, she's gone for sure. <laughs> Dude, they just throw her off the ship. She's dead already. Yeah, at this point. <laughs> Damn, she had to feed it actually so easily, though. <laughs> like, yeah, from they... Momo? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> they were having such a hard time with her. But I guess she wasn't really that strong. Yeah. Her job was pretty insane though. Like she like encloses you in the cup barrier. If they didn't have a cannon, they would probably been- I still think Violet fell through is fucking crazy. Clara Wines? No, yeah, that's, that's even crazy. more insane than you being able to read people's minds. It's just like you see everything that's going Bro, on. You're like you. you're low-key like God. Cause you're just watching everything happening. You're right, and no one knows they're being watched. And no one knows exactly. That's crazy. It's such a godly power. What's to say? Four thousand kilometers. Yeah. <laughs> that's crazy. Four thousand. That's a lot. That's you that, can that's, see so far. Yeah, that's really far. <laughs> that's crazy. That's insane. Okay, go back, back to the reveals. I can't believe this. <laughs> Damn, so he was his Don Quixote family, or was the original, original ruler. Tontadas. That's why the Tontara has 900 year relation with them because the Don Quixote family was ruling this place 900 years ago. Yeah. But then only 10 years recently, Doflamingo came back. Came back. Mm -hmm. But for, for whatever reason, like you said, why does he need to do all this if he has celestial dragon relations? Yeah, emotions? honestly. His Don Quixote family. Okay, okay, okay. So, the, so it's like complicated or what? Because like, from the way he's describing it, Don Quixote family, Don Quixote, Don Flamingo, sounds like, hey, your Don Quixote family is celestial dragon, meaning your celestial dragon. He has, he has, he has, potentially could have siblings. Yeah. Yeah, because it's like a Don Quixote family. Family. Line, right? Yeah, yeah. But it's like, I think the part that I'm still wondering about is what is the complicated part. Is, cause, could, could it be the part where you said like, oh, is it that he's only half and he's not full? No, that's like, the it's, it's still It's still hard to believe he's Celestial Dragon. Like, I'm in denial right now. He's Celestial Dragon. He's something denial. He's, he's the hottest Celestial Dragon there he is. He is. Is that why he left? He didn't take those... Yeah? He could take those goons Do you anymore. see what they're wearing? Look at him. He has this pink flamingo thing going on here, you know? Like. He looks fashionable. But the thing is, though, the way I see it is like. If he is Celestial Dragon, what's the point of all this? He wants to be like, what? King? He wants to do all this stuff. He wants to be Pirate King. But he's stronger than all the Celestial Dragons. I'm, I'm only imagining everyone in the Celestial Dragon is just like regular. So you're saying he's a Celestial Dragon that wants to be Pirate King. That's why he's doing all this? Yeah, Pirate King. Maybe he got inspired by Roger. <laughs> right? True, that could, that the, could work, yeah. Because it's been... They only show us that Pirate King thing was from Roger. So mm -hmm. potentially he could have... Wanted to become a pirate? The thing is, him saying it's complicated uh -huh. implies there's more to it than him just being a celestial dragon. Because if he just is celestial dragon, how is that complicated? You just say, Don Quixote family, celestial dragon. I'm Don Quixote family and a celestial dragon. That's not complicated. Complicated would mean like there's more factors involved that he has not mentioned yet. Because like he's saying like it's a long story, so he's like, hey, sit down and listen. He's dropping the facts right now, but this is just the start of it. True, true. So there's there's gonna be more parts. The what? part that's complicated okay. is yet to be dropped, I think. He's his, he. But he does have blood. We don't know how much blood. percentage yeah. or whatever, but that's fucking crazy though. Maybe he's exiled. Could that be it? For potentially wanting to be a pirate king. 
a very un celestial dragon of him. That's true. That is true. But the thing is, he is not outcasted because he's still able to pull strings with his celestial dragon title. Maybe his family still supports him, but his... the other celestial dragon probably looked down on him. It's the other ones do, but his family still Could supports that be it? him. It's complicated. Maybe his family always got his back, so it's not like the other celestial dragons are gonna be like, that "Oh, why are you true. taking off your helmet and stuff?" And like that is true. mingling with these commoners. commoners right? That's true. I don't know, could that be the complicated part? It's not that complicated. That's not that complicated. That's it needs why to be I'm juicier. Like, I, yeah, that's why I'm like, I feel like there has to be more, you know? <laughs> the teasing has a little too much. I feel like there has to that's be more. That's crazy. He actually is a celestial dragon. Okay, I'm still hung up on the fact that he just doesn't look like a celestial dragon. I'm sorry, like all the guys they've shown is just like impossible. Like maybe, maybe if... So do you think... If it's a woman. You know, because they showed that the woman celestial dragons still look good. Yeah, but, but they the... yet, they're yet to show any good looking celestial dragons. So it's like now that you're now you're just telling me that the flamingo is a celestial dragon, that's like May... way too hard right, for me to believe. Maybe all the Don Quixote family members are just good looking. They're all hot? They're all really hot. <laughs> they're the only kingdom? Could be. <laughs> they're the only line? Could celestial be potentially. Line? Well, so far it looks yeah, like he's the hottest powerful. out of them, right? That is true. That is true. And you think about it, he's pretty intelligent compared to the other celestial dragons that are just like, oh, I'm gonna buy these slaves. Yeah. I'm gonna have a collection, right? Mm -hmm. So. Couldn't it also be that he's half though or something, like partial, kind of like what you were thinking before? Yeah, that would make it complicated. That or would, that that, I feel like that would make things complicated then, because or... it's like your, one of your parents is a commoner, and then your other parent is a celestial dragon. Yeah, that could work, I guess. Like, well, how I see it would be like, his dad would be the celestial dragon, mm -hmm. and then the mom would be like a not a, a commoner. Mm -hmm. Then that would make things complicated. But in the end of the day, they still helped him. That's, you know. That is true. I feel like with that scenario, there would be some kind of like, oh, you're not full blood kind of thing. We're not. But that's him. if you're assuming that his own parent would discriminate against him for not being full blood, but he's the one that would have like fucked the commoner anyways. Do you, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's like, how can you know. discriminate against your own son and say, like, you're not Do they think about full... that? I don't think they think about that. But they're they? own, his own parent, though? I don't know. Because they're, they're also royalty, right? No? As well? So well, the celestial yeah. dragon and All the, the celestial and... dragons are technically royalty because they're, like, from the kingdoms, like, 800 years ago. Uh, would you still consider them royalty now? They were royalty 800 years ago. Technically, like, they're they still, still royalty, are royalty. Yeah. I guess it's just like if if the current time still acknowledges that royalty, you and know? They, yeah, they still and they, they still, still do. They still do. They still yeah. do. So I think you, yeah, you can technically consider all celestial dragons to still be royalty. But like Vivi's country was supposed to, be, so she's a celestial dragon then technically. Is she? <laughs> they turned it down. But technically, if. Like what's considered celestial dragons is if you move to, if you were one of the countries that joined and then moved to Marie Joy, right? But then she just she ticks off the part where she was the country. Yeah. But just not the part where she's living with them. So technically, That's she crazy. she is kind of in a way. In I a think way, so. yeah. unofficially, I think. Unofficially, so. yeah. Like if they turn it down, do they still get the perks? Probably, right? I Actually, don't know. No, I don't, no so. I don't know. I don't think so. Cause like back in Alabasta, they were like having such a fucking difficult time. Like if they were able to just pull whatever fucking strings, That's true. they could have fucking just got rid of Crocodile. That's right? True. And Crocodile wanted to mess with a a kind of a celestial. But they don't have the power though. Yeah, that's true. That's the thing. Yeah. So what's the benefit of them? Let's say the twenty countries or kingdom. they're part of the world government, but that's just. I think that's the front-facing part, like the world-facing, where world government. But technically speaking, everyone from Marie Joy has indefinite power to do whatever they want. Well, that kind of sucks saying like, oh, you don't live there now, you don't have that power. Even though they were committed to the founding of the world government. That's is true. that is that what they're saying right there, man? Like, But isn't it to show that the Marie Joy is like the corruption already? Vivi and Dunn, they don't, they don't partake in that. They that's don't partake true. in that corruption. So what do they get at the end of the, end of the what do they get at the end of the they're day? They're still making like the decisions and stuff of the 
government. Yeah, but yeah, that's what fault the rest of the noble. Okay, though, that's right? the thing. They like went from slash the dragon to just now like a country noble yeah. kind of. No, but that I think that is the thing though, no? Because like technically speaking, the the world government they're not supposed to have like this kind of rule where they just do whatever the fuck they want. It's just because that's their cor- the celestial dragons are corrupted. They are yes. that they're doing all this, right? Technically mm-hmm. speaking. If uh, just because you're part of the world government doesn't mean you can now be like, hey, send out the admirals to kill this person. You know, you can't do that. But because they're celestial dragons, they have more say than the world government. I guess, yeah. The thing is, I don't know if like 800 years ago when this was formed, they already were thinking this far ahead that it was going to be like this. They probably never foresaw it becoming corrupted like this, right? Yeah, we can say that. Right, yeah. so maybe okay. like Vivi's family, when they, they didn't, they never thought that there would be these celestial dragon perks. Uh, you that know, because this be is this is something might, that might have came up true, after true. after the fact, right? And like the, when when things were being established, okay, it might have just sense. been like, oh, do you want to live here mm-hmm. with everyone? And they so just that, said that's no. the that's the beginning. So that's, that's the before start. the perks, before the corruption, yeah, celestial dragon corruption, yeah, and it's that now that the current celestial dragons are abusing their power because of the past mm-hmm. like they're getting away from everything so now mm-hmm. they're just the offsprings are just mm-hmm. you know getting worse and worse yeah. but since they decide not to go there they're just living their normal life so yeah. they don't even know about these perks yeah they wouldn't know because they're think. just living normal yeah because they wouldn't be entangled with the okay. celestial dragon like activities sure but i think one thing that i'm kind of wondering now is because the whole like blank century thing mm-hmm. so does that mean uh Alabasta has something to do with it? Is that what you're Alabasta trying to say? would have had something to do with it because those countries, remember when they, they did, they, they teamed it up, up to it was like they teamed the up to fight up against this one kingdom, right? Mm-hmm. And then they won, and that, that was the, how they were able to form the world government. So now I'm like, wait a minute, Alabasta was part of it? <laughs> like Vivi's predecessor? I mean, not her directly, but like they would have been, like a... been yeah, involved. They right? would, I think they would have been involved, right? Because yeah. I think the story was that they teamed up against this kingdom because they felt threatened. Mm-hmm. But wait, hold on. Isn't that kind of strange as a polygraph within Alabasta? Mm-hmm. If Alabasta took part in the defeat of this kingdom. Isn't that kind of weird? Oh, you're saying... No, I think about it. Maybe, maybe they were... Maybe they were in on maybe it. Maybe they were allies somehow. Yeah. Maybe they were in on it. They're like pretending. To be... to be part of the world government, but then they're actually helping them, so now they're... Potentially, concerned. yeah. That's right? what I want to think. I want to think, like, right? it would be weird that they have a polygraph in their country. That's true, that, that is true. That they're protecting, yeah. even though um, Dolph Flamingo is now claiming that Vivi's family was right. one of the kingdoms that right. founded them. Right, because also because the government's trying to get rid of them. Yeah. So it's like if he's protecting, if they're protecting them. Was th- okay. Was that Alabasta though, or was that Skypia? I can't re- recall now. Skypia is the golden one. Yeah, but but Alabasta also had polygraphs. I can't recall. Exactly Alabasta that. had the polygraph at the end, um, at the tomb. Yeah. Because Robin, uh, right. Cro- Crocodile found right. it, and that that's I where the last that. fight was. Right, because she wanted to read them. I remember. She wanted to find the history, yeah, but, it but just, there was no info about yeah, the, okay. the blank century. And mm, then. It was about the Pluton. It was a Pluton, but then true. the crocodiles backstabbed Robin at that point. Actually, yeah, that's true. Right? That, yeah. That would no, contradict, that would, right? Yeah, that would. Because oh, it's like you were part of the countries that defeated That, that eliminated them. Why are you keeping history? So or maybe, something they, maybe they were like secretly allies. Maybe they could, they potentially, they could be allies. Because then, like, um, if. If this, if uh, the Vivi's country, I forget what it's called, Alabasta. Alabasta. Yeah, yeah I, don't, I forget what the nation is though. But like, if they pretend to be part of this world government, then then they can help them preserve those pollen flips. Because they're protected. Because they're protected now. You're under. You're I mean, under you'll never the find it. It's in the yeah. tomb. Yeah. I don't know if there's more scattered around. Yeah. Actually, in a way, can we say like potentially there is a high chance that Vivi's family were like allied with the kingdom in some way just because of how he rules i think so you know how like um celestial dragons like they have bad rep now Mm -hmm. that's from like over time Mm -hmm. you know they just keep abusing it right Mm -hmm. their parents and stuff but it's like if we look at alabasta the king is 
good. Mm -hmm. So I'm only assuming that the previous kings, you know, like kind of like would be good. rubbed off to them. Mm -hmm. You know, the parents showing the, oh, the kid yeah. how to actually be a good king. True. So it's like they must have been like good people then. Mm -hmm. Right, because you're saying like whoever is in the position of a king, you would teach the next person the same kind of morals and standing. Or the, or or matters. yeah, or they just watch. You know, yeah. they just watch and learn and pick up that kind of yeah, stuff, right? Yeah, true. And just like, I guess, like if you don't see like that kind of characteristic in someone, you probably wouldn't trust that kind of person yeah. to give it to you. So you're saying like in, they were inherently good people. Yeah, that's what I want to believe hmm. because of um, the current and king then, and Bibi. You know? And that's why they would have had some kind of entanglement with Maybe. that kingdom. Potentially. Hmm. Great. Oh, true. But then oh, look, another thing is like they somehow they knew D the, what was it? I'm just gonna call it D Kingdom. <laughs> D Kingdom, sure, okay. D Kingdom. So like D Kingdom, right? They knew, remember? That they were gonna. That they were gonna. Someone's after. Oh, that's why the point was kind of could it be possible They're that spreading. they were the ones that gave them the intel. <laughs> oh, like they the gave them the intel that someone's coming, and then they have some of the polyglots too, so they could help them keep some, and then like they spreading more polyglots because they they spread the polyglots prior to them knowing that they were That's going true. to be attacked. So then they had to get that intel somehow, mm -hmm. and then if um, the Vivi's uh, nation, or whatever, was uh, allied already with like the other countries mm -hmm. and part of like this. Like in maybe not established yet world government, but they were in Above the midst yeah, of like yeah. establishing mm -hmm. it. Then he could have like gave that War, info, warned them or yeah, something. Gave them the heads up that could, that was coming for could them. Could be, could be. Yeah, because like I feel like they wouldn't be able to do anything themselves because it's like there's too much, right? Like as a country, you still want to think about your own country. Yeah, first. like so it's let's like, say you are allies with them. Like yeah. you can't side with them. Now exactly. you're fighting the other nineteen countries. Yeah, then, right? exactly. So oh. I feel like they for them maybe like they didn't want to fight this kingdom, but mm -hmm. then they still had to choose to be with this within this alliance otherwise they would make enemies for could, the could other uh, countries right that would make sense it would be a tough decision yeah, like, yeah i think so that could be it that tontada said the history goes back 900 years 900. ago but That's 800 right before. years ago is when they established the government and they actually moved so then for a hundred years they were fucking torturing the tontada people true and then the Basically. rest would just be riku yeah, Royalty then I in. think the Riku family would have moved in after. So then I guess for the past 800 years until recently, 10 years ago, when Doflamingo came back again. Damn, they were having it good. They were they were good, yeah. So that's why they said that it's just recently that Doflamingo came back. That's why they have to fight him. Mm. But the history dates back 900 years ago because they were like being tortured for that's like, insane. like 100 years or whatever. Does that mean the Navy can't even do anything to um, Doflamingo? Even if he did, like, let's say he did but do no something. But no one knows, though. Do no they, one knows they, he's celestial. They don't, they don't know. They haven't heard about the Don Quixote family. Dude, Akainu doesn't know. Remember when oh, he was shit. like, when oh, he, they were yeah, like, right. they he's, thought he resigned, and then they're like, and then Akainu was like, what the hell's yeah, going on? Yeah, he's like, what's happening? Yeah. You're right, they don't they know don't that know. he's a celestial dragon. If they knew already, then they were just being like, oh, fuck, he's like, he's doing his shit, you know? Like, he's using his, yeah. his celestial dragon um, powers, but... They didn't, they didn't do that. Yo, anyone, I technically anyone who hits, hits mm -hmm. Doflamingo, technically he could be like, that's it. I kind of go work for me, go, go kill me. Yeah, he literally could. <laughs> what? Well, we don't know if it's him directly. Because yeah, he doesn't yeah. live in Marie Joy right now. So we can't so, call him. So I feel like it's Currently someone it's else. Dragon, like, right? He has to his, has, his he has to use whatever connection his yeah. connection is. Because he's not in Marie Joy anymore. Mm -hmm. So I feel like he maybe he doesn't have any say on that. For now, because yeah. he's not in it. That's probably the complicated part. Oh, is that okay, he yeah. can't do that those things directly. But his family His can. family or connection. And his family, his family yeah, loves can. him. Maybe. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everyone. If you guys enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up. It really helps with the channel. And if you're new here, make sure to hit the subscribe button below. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Peace.